In this video I'm going to show you how to create a link to a content collection folder. What we're going to do is we're going to start by going to the content collection area in the course management section um, on the control panel and I'm going to click the course code to take me to that course content collection. So here's my content collection and I'm going to create the folder that I want to basically put all my files in. So I'm going to call this um, files for your lesson and press submit. So here's my folder that I've created. So in order to create a link to that I'm going to go to the place on this course where I want that link to be. I'm going to say build items, build content and go to an item. I'm going to name this item lesson files. I'm then going to, in the text box, click the attach file button just above and I'm going to browse the content collection. Then I'm going to tick the box next to the folder I just created, files for your lesson, and press submit. A warning comes up saying that this will give explicit read permission for this item to members of this course or organization. Well that's the reason why I've linked it, so that my students can see that. So I'm going to press OK. I could now leave it as a link called Files for Your Lesson, but I prefer to call this link Click Here. I then also want it to launch in a new window. This will make it open in a new tab or a new window, and once they've got the files they need, they can close it and come back to my Blackboard course. Press Submit. It gives me now a preview of what this link will look like. And um, I press Submit again and it's put it in here. Now I like to add some description for the students, so for the files from the lesson. Then I press submit. So now here we go, I have a nice link to a folder and when I click this it opens a new tab and here is the folder. So I can upload a file to here and there it is. Close this tab, click the link again and the students can see those files.